right, guys, what's up? JP here with Brian. We're going to go out here on a, one of our permissions and see what we can come up with. And uh, hopefully uh, we'll come up with something really good. We're only uh, going to be out here for about an hour and a half, two hours. It's a beautiful day. And uh, this is on the outskirts of Antietam. Most of uh, our permissions are full of crops. So unfortunately, we can't hit our uh, really good spots. But hopefully we'll come up with something nice here. So stick with us and see what we find. <laughs> All right, guys, take it easy. Well, we just got here, and uh, I looks like I have a fired, probably 54 caliber round ball, which would be Confederate because we're at a Union position. So it was about nice. four inches down, and there you go. That's awesome. All right. Get it done. Uh, we've only been here five minutes. All right, guys, stick with us. All right, Brian just uh, called. Looks like he might have something. What you got, man? He just called. Said it's a good signal, so we'll check him out. He just found his bullet probably about five minutes ago in the same area. What you got? Oh, I see lead. Oh, yeah? <laughs> oh, there it is in the hole. Let me see where. Oh, sweet. I can't see it because it's shattered, but pull that thing it? out. It's a three ringer. Nice. Beautiful. That's what I'm talking about. That thing looks dropped. Two pull. That's deep too. Is it dropped or fired? It's dropped. Beautiful oh, nice. drops. Wow, it's clean up nicely. Nice. Can you see it? That's gorgeous. 50, 58. <laughs> congratulations. Nice. What? We've been out here, what, 15 minutes? If that, yeah. All right, man. Congratulations. Thank you. All right. All right. I think I'm uh, going to come kick you out of this area. <laughs> Right. And just pulled this out. It's a poker chip. Looks like it is a uh, smushed down, maybe like 58 caliber or American Civil War bullet that's been smushed down into a poker chip. Awesome. All right, guys. Hopefully, uh, I'll find some more stuff. All right. I don't know if you guys can see it. Just a little tiny baby fawn right there. Just ran into the woods. Wildlife, gotta love it. Hey guys, just dug a really good signal. Check it out. Look in the hole. Sitting right here. It is. It's definitely a three ringer, and I can't tell if it's fired or dropped, but it looks like it might be dropped. Three ringer. We're on the board, at least I am. <laughs> Brian, you've been on for two now, right? So yes. this is our third one. We've been out here for what? About 45 minutes. About 45 minutes. It's starting out uh, start out good and then, uh, so, three ringer. Here we go. We're going to see what else we can find. All right, we got another good signal. It's about a 72. It's eight inches down, which is really promising. Uh, most of the bullets we've been finding has been about six to eight inches down. So we're going to hit do a live dig on this one see what we come up with. soil looks promising like it's never been tilled or anything, you know what I mean, Brian? Yep. It's a good signal, so... Alright, I shot out of the hole, but that's a high signal now, so it doesn't sound like it would be a bullet. But you never know. But you never know. Mm. That's not a good sign. Heck. Hmm. It's a small target, maybe. I don't know. Maybe it's a bucking ball. Hold on. Oh, it's it's right, there. right there. Why am I pinpointing working? All right, we're going to end this video so I can figure out what the heck is going on. All right. All right, check this hole out. <laughs> I tore this ground up. That signal that I couldn't find. There it is. It looks like it's some sort of chisel tip. I don't know, but it's uh, definitely heavy steel or iron of some sort, and it looks like it's been hammered on the one side. So um, who knows, but it was definitely deep, and uh, we'll have to clean it up and see what it is. All right, guys.